once in a while, he teams up with this sweet little girl named Lauren Edmonds, <laughs> who's a little Southern girl, and her family brings us St. Clair sides. And when this is all together on the table, that is a delicious meal. That's right. So thanks for coming together for us for a holiday. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. we'd love to. So this, everybody, is our November food of the month, and it's been so popular already that one of the choices is already sold out. So let me quickly tell you what you can pick from. We have a delicious Corky's ham or turkey, smoked turkey, and you can choose for your immediate ship either one. However, if you want the December shipment, the ham is already sold out. But any one that you choose is coming along with St. Clair sides. Yeah. And you actually went and went back to the drawing board and figured out we did. Which ones our customers order the most, right? Yeah. And which are their favorites? They've given you the most best feedback mm -hmm. on, and these are the three. First time for three used to all be two. Three. Yes. You're getting all three, so yeah. you don't have to choose all the favorites. You don't have to leave one out. You don't have to only you know mix and right. mix and match. You get all three. That four cheese mac and cheese, that delicious sweet potato casserole right. that's like dessert with uh -huh. brown sugar on the top. Look at that. And then the cornbread stuffing. Right. And all three. So y'all tell me, no South yes. Southern already. I like it. Um, <laughs> tell me how many people is this going to serve? So we figure 10 people, okay, nice easy, size. Easy. The, right, the meat, yeah. the, both of them are boneless, whether you do the ham or the turkey, mm -hmm. and then six pounds of size. Oh boy, So yum. It's, a, it's a lot of food, yeah, now, it goes you, a long way. You could get both meats if you want. You yes. can still yeah. get both for the uh, right now shipment, mm -hmm. which will Absolutely. be there for Thanksgiving. And then have some extra sides. That's right. Or maybe you need double sides for as many people as you have coming there over. There you go. Yes. So think about doing that as yes. well. Okay, so let's talk about what okay. you want to do the ham This first? is the ham. We'll okay. start with this one first. So All we've right. only done this ham a couple of times over mm -hmm. the last couple of years. Yeah. This is a carving board ham. It's totally boneless, and you slice it yourself. So it's applewood smoked, mm -hmm. Carolyn. Yeah. And then after we smoke it, we uh, we put this brown sugar glaze on the Yum. top, so it's a little smoky, a little sweet. But look how tender it is, and the presentation I think is fantastic because you get to decide the thickness of the slice and the presentation. Whether you put it on one of those Temptations platters just mm -hmm. there, imagine having this sliced a little bit mm -hmm. and then letting your uh, guests slice the rest. But when have you seen a ham? that is this tender and juicy. Oh boy. And then that glaze just kind of melts down over the top of that, Karen. Oh my gosh. Now, it is uh, phenomenal. Frank is updating me already. The immediate ship turkey is very popular. Let me mention this too. If you somehow missed out on the December shipment of the ham, get the immediate ship and stick it in your freezer. That's right. That's right. You know, that you can get it out for a December meal, yes. Christmas meal or whatever. That's why you might want to consider getting both and have your turkey That's right. for right. Thanksgiving and then save that ham, the immediate for ship Christmas. ham for Christmas. Yeah, or New Year's. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. So, and this is the turkey right here. Okay. So, this is the one that we've been doing for the last couple of Novembers. It is, it's boneless. It is seasoned, and then we smoke it, and then we put that same fantastic brown sugar, oh, apple man. cider vinegar glaze on top. And so, it's it's already done for you. All you're doing is thaw, heat, and eat. Oh, that's and those so easy. sides go perfectly with either one of these turkeys, with the turkey or the ham. And remember, we've always just done the turkey in two sides. Mm -hmm. This time we've given you the choice of the ham or the turkey, and now you get all three of the favorites. So, so we basically we, we get everything. You get and, it all. And, and, and the one thing <laughs> I all mentioned favorites. is you can get, oh, look at that mac and cheese. Oh, you guys, goodness. you can get auto delivery. And you can get this coming in March of 2018 for Easter yeah. as well. And lock in today's price, our food of the month price, four easy payments, all of that otherwise is going away at the end of the month of November mm. or whenever they sell out, whichever comes first. <laughs> That's right. All right. Oh, look at that mac and cheese. Isn't that so get good. out, Lori. It looks amazing that because is it is amazing. So good. You put four, <laughs> what four cheeses do you put in yes, there? Yes, a sharp cheddar, Asiago, Monterey Jack, mm -hmm. and mozzarella cheese. And then, of course, we put more cheese on top that creates that beautiful, Beautiful brown crust that gets kind of uh, cheesy. Mm. That I look, don't you love that toasted cheese? That I, I just love, love that on top. That uh, on no top. offense, Jimmy, but I'm gonna go stand by. Get home. over here! Come on. <laughs> so this mac and cheese. Oh boy, will you guys, that looks be so awesome good. with the turkey or the ham. This is probably our most um, one of our most popular. Our two most popular are the sweet potatoes and the mac and cheese. And then of course the third mm -hmm. most popular is the cornbread dressing. And you're getting all three. I'll That's just remind right. you. Well, and I, I will tell you, we've tried them all several times at our house, right. and they are something you definitely want to keep on hand in your freezer. Definitely. Thank you very much. You can uh, go for that. Time for a yummy face. Yeah. Mm, 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 mm. Oh. Isn't that good? It's so good. It just warms you up, doesn't yeah. it? This has got to be some of the best mac and cheese on the planet. <laughs> well, thank you. That's and quite a compliment. Can I just say something? <laughs> These guys do all the cooking. 
You're not going right. to open this up and get a big instruction sheet of do this and do that and change it into this pan and do that and add this. It's thaw it out, put it in the oven, heat it up, and eat it. That's right. right. And another thing is you don't we've have been to talking do about is, you know, one of my favorite things is for Thanksgiving, we had the family over. Or we used when I was growing mm. up, going to my grandmother's house, the house smelled like Thanksgiving to right. me. Mm -hmm. And that's to me is important. And you mm -hmm. don't lose that here because right. you're still cooking it. So the aroma coming out of the oven still gives you that fantastic Thanksgiving holiday meal ar aroma in your house, which, oh boy, right. which to me just makes me think And once you smell this sweet potato casserole cooking in your <laughs> oven, you guys are going to be fighting over this topping right here. This mm. is our brown sugar, pecan, and walnut crust sweet potato mm. casserole. You can see the fresh sweet potato Let me just chunks come in still the, in my, there. With my mac and cheese fork. And have <laughs> there you go. That's right. Mm. It's like praline on top. I love it's the topping. It's just delicious. And mm. with the ham, to me, the sweet potatoes with the ham mm -hmm. or the turkey, really. That is like I just love the combination. Isn't that so great? good. That's like sweet potato pie. Isn't it? it? Is. It's, it's like delicious. dessert. It's like a dessert. Oh but you can my call gosh. it a vegetable, right? right. <laughs> you put no sugar on top, it's a vegetable. <laughs> it's a vegetable underneath. That's right. Okay, and then the stuffing. And then I've the stuffing. really fallen in love with cornbread stuffing. Uh -huh. I never had so that good. as a child. Well, you know, in the South Carolina, we call it dressing. It's, it's, we uh, call it dress dressing. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. And it's moist. It is. It's it's so phenomenal. We, we dice our own celery and onions that go in this, and then oh we have gosh. southern spices, tons of sage. We um, we mm. do cornbread, of course, and then buttermilk and chicken broth, and it just stays so moist. Look how moist this is. It's almost like a cakey texture. And stuffing is a lot of work, or it dressing, yes. whatever you call so it. You have to yep. bake the got, cornbread. Well, up, first then, of all, you got to cut up all the onions and cut right. up all the celery mm -hmm. and get all the spices and that. tear up all the so bread delicious. and let it sit out overnight so that's it right. gets all crunchy. It doesn't even need gravy. And this is so easy, or else you get it out of a bag, and that's not that's yeah, yeah, it is. Um, oh, this, this is so, so much better. Good. This is so much better. Yeah. Fresh vegetables mm, in there. Definitely. Just goes perfect. So, the, you know, again, you get to have all your fantastic mm. holiday family over, but you're still serving good food. Right. It's not like it's a substitution. It's not as good. I mean, I don't know what could possibly be homemade better than that stuffing. That That's is true. so good. That is true. That is oh my, my dad's gosh. recipe, and we swear by oh, that recipe. Oh, it's delicious. I love it. Well, tell me a little bit about St. Clair, because uh, some of our customers are new, mm -hmm. and they might not know who you are. Sure, of course. We're a family business. We're out of Memphis, Tennessee, just like Corky's Barbecue. That's right. Mm -hmm. And um, my dad started the business 41 years ago, and my brother and I are both involved with the business now, and mm -hmm. we just keep it all in the family. We keep our so family good. recipes, and that's what, how we come up with these awesome mm -hmm. foods that we love sharing with you guys mm -hmm. through QVC. Oh, my gosh. So a meal for about 10, did you say? It is, yeah. yeah. Okay. Because you got to think four and three quarters pounds of meat mm -hmm. and no, there's no bone. So you get end to end and then six pounds a side. So it's over 10 right. pounds of food. Let and me I say too, um, I know a lot of you like to do some of the stuff homemade. Mm -hmm. Here's my yeah. suggestion. Get this. Mm -hmm. If you want to make your own green bean casserole or some family favorite that you have, that's, that's right. grandma's recipe. Yep. You know, Thanksgiving should have about 10 sides on the table right. anyway. It really should. Exactly. But you've got the basic core of the meal right here. So they've saved you a lot of work. The right. turkey is often the hardest thing to fix. And frankly, a lot of us aren't real good at it. <laughs> uh, or maybe you're going to somebody's house that you're not quite sure if they're good at the turkey or not. So you're like, well, why don't I bring my Corky's turkey? That's right. That's well, and, right. And how many of us, I know that we, I have like a Friendsgiving that I go to. Mm -hmm. How awesome would it be mm -hmm. for you to bring this to your Friendsgiving or to mm -hmm. your friend function mm -hmm. or whatever? And, and mm -hmm. that's maybe not on your family mm -hmm. Thanksgiving day. Oh, that right. would be so great. Mm -hmm. Oh, my gosh. And Carolyn, it's no work for you. So good. It, it's no work for yeah, you. Go ahead and if over you there. if you can't get to your family Thanksgiving this year, or mm -hmm. your kids can't come to you, but you mm -hmm. want to do some, you you're the one that usually cooks. Right. This is a perfect way to send it to them ahead of time, and. They don't have to do any work, but they get that fantastic mm -hmm. homemade. Look at, look right. at that turkey. That turkey is so look good. how juicy that turkey and remember, is. Remember, this is a turkey breast. Yeah. Uh, there's nothing you have to pull out of it or shave off of it. Or, you know, if it's your family, you only eat the white meat. You know, and a lot of people are like that. You know, they, they don't eat the rest of it. You throw, end up throwing a lot of food away. And you're only eating the turkey breast anyway. That's why turkey breasts have become so popular yeah, it, uh, for Thanksgiving. <coughs> Pardon me. Um, this is a turkey breast. There's no bones. It's right. delicious. It's moist. It's easy. All you do is heat it up. It's already seasoned. It's already basted. It's got all the stuff on it. You can add some of that little bit of, uh, of the honey sauce. Yeah, the glaze the, the comes glaze. on the top. It's seasoned. The glaze is already on top. But I want you to see this right here. So we leave the skin on. It's a beautiful presentation. One, mm -hmm. it's seasoned and then smoked. So you get that nice color. Mm -hmm. Then the glaze goes on the top. <clears throat> but I want you to see this. 
Look how tender. Yeah, it's super Look moist. How tender you can this cut is. it with a fork. You it's can. Awesome. And you know, a lot of times the white meat of a turkey, the turkey breast can be a little dry. Not this right here. Not our mm -hmm. turkey because of the way we slow smoke it. Right. And oh, then boy. add that glaze so, on at the end. Now when you say smoked turkey, does yeah. that taste like ham? No. What's a smoked turkey taste so like? It Jimmy? just has a little bit of that hickory flavor. Okay. Uh, just like our ribs, but it's not overpowering because really the true star is the meat. Yeah. Okay. And then we love this glaze at the very end. It was super popular last year. So we came back with the this year, this apple cider, uh, I'm sorry, this brown sugar apple cider vinegar glaze. It has a little tiny bit of molasses, so you can see this fantastic, Almost fantastic flavor. Yeah, yes. the smoke flavor is subtle to me. It and is you get real the subtle. Smoke, and then you get the savery, and then you get the maple. It's just sweet. the perfect combination. Oh, that's Isn't that delicious. Good? Oh, man. See, I love the surprise when people try it. They're like, I don't know, let me try a smoked <laughs> turkey. And then they're like, oh, it's so it's moist the and flavorful. And, the moist. and yeah. you know what it's not? It's not one of those rolled meats. No, it's, you know, not, it's, like, it's not a deli turkey it's, or a deli. Not, it does, it's, no, no, yeah, no. It's not one of those, you know, shaped, it's got turkey, it says turkey, but it doesn't no, no, taste no, no, like no, turkey. No, 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 no. This oh, is a whole, whole turkey breast. That's like this a fresh, delicious turkey breast that you roasted. Yeah, yes. I'll, I'll, I'll take some of that, please. Okay. Oh, boy. <laughs> okay. Um, Thank so you. So here's an update. So far this month, over 12,000 orders have been taken. Wow. Thank you. Thanks so much. <laughs> if you want the ham... There's only 1,200 left, and that's only for the immediate ship because the December shipment ham has completely sold out. So if you want the ham, whether you're going to have it in November or December, yep. get it now while there's 1,200 left because you can save it for December. You can save it for December. Definitely. If you want to, yep. um, get the turkey, and then you'll have double sides. Right. If you get one of each, they are on Easy Pay today, and we have it for you on four payments of less than $25. That's a sale price that goes away at the end of November. I don't seriously doubt they're going to last that long. <laughs> I but, know. We, we never hardly have enough to yeah. go around for Free Thanksgiving. Free shipping. Right. It's but, a good deal. But what you were talking about getting two of them earlier. Mm -hmm. So my family is huge. My, my wife is from a huge family. So mm -hmm. when we have a lot of people over, this is what we serve. Yep. We do this cornbread dressing. It's mm -hmm. very easy. Sweet potatoes and mac and cheese and the turkey. This is what we do. If you get two, we take two of the casseroles, yep. the same ones, and put them in a 9 by 13 pan. Mm -hmm. You bake mm -hmm. them off, and it's like a big family right. style uh, of one of each of the sides. Oh, so that's great. That's yep. what we do. We do two of them. That's a yeah. good idea. Yeah, put, yeah. This in, put two of these in a 9 by 13, just pop them out frozen. Mm -hmm. They cook beautifully. Yeah, yes. you don't have to thaw the sides out first. No, no. no. You do want to no. thaw your meat. Yeah, I figure if you're doing this for Thanksgiving, pull it out and put it in your refrigerator on Tuesday. Okay. Yep. That gives you two days. And then about an hour before you're ready to um, serve your meal, that's all about an hour, which you can't beat that. No, my <laughs> gosh, are you kidding? And then you still get that fantastic aroma because and you're you not are cooking spending, it. cooking all day and spending all oh your time gosh. in the kitchen. You can actually watch the Macy's Parade. And you know what else? If you go to the grocery store and you're going to make three side dishes, you know how many ingredients are in each one. Yeah. Plus the meat, plus the yeah, seasonings. It adds up. It adds up. Plus the cost it, of your time. Exactly. So uh, let's say hi to Maisie. Oh, one of my favorite <laughs> names. It's my favorite doggy's name, too. Hi, Maisie in Maryland. How are you? <laughs> I'm doing fine. It's very nice to meet you. Please meet Jimmy and Lauren. Hi, Maisie. Hi, Jimmy and Lauren. How are you? I'm fine, and I just want to say how much I love you both. Oh, that's nice. Thank, thank you. you. Oh, that's All awesome. three of us. Yeah, thank you. Exactly. <laughs> Thanks, honey. Uh, so Absolutely. You're, you're a Corky's fan, Maisie? I am a Corky's fan and a St. Saint Saint Clair's, Clair's fan. fan. Oh, that's great. Thank you. I love hearing Absolutely. that. Absolutely. And the thing is, is that I've been big fans for years. Yeah. So this uh, offer that you had, I couldn't resist. I ordered for both dates. Oh, oh good wow. for you. Good. That's and, awesome. And each date, I got the ham and the turkey. Oh, wow. my gosh. Your family's going to be so happy. <laughs> and then let me tell you this, too. When you cook this up, that's exactly what I'm going to be having on my yep, Thanksgiving. Me too. So we'll be, they'll be there together. <laughs> Yum, yum. Absolutely. And the, the, I have to say, I've, I've had the turkey breast uh, for a couple of years. Mm -hmm. Right. They make the best sandwiches the oh. day after. See? And yes. also, I would dice it up and make some soup. Oh, oh nice. great idea. That's perfect. So the leftover factor, that's Absolutely. great. And since yes, you... and, the, and the glaze on the skin even uh, season the soup up even better. Mm. Yes, thank you. And so... I know you've gotten the turkey before and you hadn't gotten the ham, but let me tell you what to do with the ham. You talked about leftovers for a sandwich. Cut you a slice of that ham like this mm -hmm. the next day and cook you up some biscuits from the, oh. from the grocery store. Fry this up in a skillet mm. and put it on top of that biscuit for the next morning. That is a phenomenal breakfast. Yum. Oh, that sounds good. <laughs> and, 
And Lauren, keep doing a great job with St. Clair's. I love your mac and cheese. Oh, I know. thank you your so sweet much. sweet potatoes, the dressing. And uh, I've tried other uh, products that you have, too. So uh, for anyone who who are guessing about what to do, go for it. All oh, right. Thank, thank you, Maisie. so much. Thank you. What a great call. Thanks yeah. so much. So and, awesome. Thank and we're you. happy you've been pleased. And please